Pluralsight is an online service with pretty high quality videos where you can learn various programming concepts and languages like C Sharp, Python, SQL, to more specific things like defensive programming. I have actually received Pluralsight for free from IBM for over a year, and I think it's safe to say that I got my time worth on it. Some of the courses are interactive, which is actually pretty impressive. They're videos, and then they'll test your knowledge by running the code or maybe even SQL, but they're too far in and in between. Most, if not all, courses, you can actually take a multiple choice quiz and they'll give you a score based on how you do, plus you can share it afterwards. This is a nice touch, but it's not really definitive proof of knowledge, especially since you can take it again after watching more videos on the topic or wait X amount of days. One of the biggest gripes I have is some of the courses are obsolete. I heard the Angular one was pretty dated, but there was also one course, I think it was Python related, I can't remember where it was so obsolete I couldn't even download what was needed to follow along. I say one of the biggest gripes because instead of upgrading some of their content, they decided to give us badges, basically like PlayStation trophies or Microsoft achievements where you get rewards based on tasks that you do, like watching certain videos for a certain number of times or whatever. Another thing that's annoying is you can't watch a video and then quickly go to the next one a certain amount of times. Pluralsight will lock you out of your account if you do it too many times in a row. I'm thinking it's a security risk. I asked them about it, and they said basically you get one warning, and then that's it. They can close your account. Keep in mind that this service is $30 a month. If I want to skip certain videos, then I should be able to, period. The good news is they do have, I believe, a week trial. Just make sure to cancel beforehand if you're not completely satisfied. If you genuinely can't find tutorials on the topic, then I say give it a shot. This is what happened to me when I had my first internship. I was to learn Grails, which is uh, Groovy on Rails. Another video for another day, perhaps. And Pluralsight had a pretty good tutorial on it. The main thing, however, is that there's almost an unlimited amount of free content out there. YouTube alone has countless hours on JavaScript, Python, C++, or most topics you want to watch. That doesn't even include other places or services, which I'll gladly get into in the future. Pluralsight is one of those services that I wish I could like more, but I can't. That doesn't mean it's bad, I just don't think it's worth $30 a month for an extended period of time.